51-year-old Sharon McDowell recently found out the weakness, fatigue, and balance troubles she was suffering are signs of multiple sclerosis. I was watching my body go downhill and I couldn't stop it, and I, and I didn't know what to do. Now hitting the gym is helping her. In the first study of its kind, researchers at the University of Florida ask MS patients to try weight training using regular gym equipment. We designed an exercise study that was fairly gentle, specifically focused on the legs, to see if eight weeks of training twice a week for about a half an hour would increase their leg strength. Previous research with aerobic exercise showed promise, but researchers didn't know what to expect from pumping iron. Whether or not that might translate into a better walking performance, and how might that affect their perception of fatigue and their perception of disability. The exercise is focused on building leg, back, and core strength. We found a significant increase in leg strength. We also found that they were able to do a stepping test, and they were able to increase their stepping speed or rate of stepping. Be sure to check with your doctor before trying any type of exercise. MS is an unpredictable disease, and strength training may not be right for everyone. My walking is um, better. I don't get quite as tired as fast. Going up and down steps um, is, is better. Beyond getting stronger, Sharon's regular workouts gave her more confidence. I don't feel like I'm at the bottom of a hole anymore. She can't stop the disease, but by living stronger, she's determined to slow it down. For WebMD, I'm Sandy Lamott.